I was out here running at Pal Butte, and I got to thinking that I had a couple of ounces to make. In the uh, St. Helens video, I said that um, that Mount Hood was going to be the next video. And that wasn't right. Uh, I got two more videos planned before Mount Hood, which is in Mount Hood's going to be in September. Probably end of September, I think. Um, so I got number one is I'm going to try to get over to Smith Rock, which is in Central Oregon, and totally different terrain than this. It's more of a high desert. So I'm going to get over there and try to get Justin and Jake to go with me and video that. So I sent them a text today, today, but I haven't heard anything back. So hopefully they'll they'll join in. Uh, it's just so much more fun when you know you got more than one. You go by yourself. It's, it's kind of like recording this video now. It's just anyway. Hopefully they'll go. Um, so that's that's the first video that I got planned for this month, and then. First week of August, I'm gonna be in West Virginia visiting family. There is a, while I'm there, I'm gonna be doing a race. It's the KT, or Canal Trace, it's called KT 50K. I think it was a 10K and 25K also. But I've done the 50K five times in the past. I think it's five times. Um, and I'll tell you what, that is just, that is a wonderful race. The race director, People want to pick up dog poop. The the race director, uh, well, I should say race directors, Daniel and Corey, they do an incredible job. I mean, they they really do. Aid stations are perfect. Um, food afterwards. The registration price is one of the cheapest in probably in the nation for such a, a good race. And and there's there, it's a it's a popular race too. It's not like it's you know, inaugural race or something. They've been doing it for a long time and they've kept the price down. And I know in the past that price included swag bag, t-shirt, uh, usually like a pint glass of some kind, uh, food at the end. I mean, and uh, it's point to point. It includes bus ride to the start line. Amazing, it's an amazing race. So I'm, I am super excited to be able to go back and do that race. So. I do have a small goal for that race, and that is to break six hours. Uh, in the past, I've gotten close, like six hours and 20 minutes, maybe six hours and 23 minutes. So my goal this, this time is gonna be to break six hours. Pretty sure that I can do it. Um, I feel like I'm in probably the best shape that I've ever been in, well, as far as running goes. But um, anyway, See what else do I got? Oh, I want to thank the subscribers. Thank you. And I want to thank Stefan, which is subscribed today. And all the viewers. And wow, the viewers on the Western States 100, uh, where I paced Andrew. I never dreamed that that would get so many views. We, we clicked over 2,000 today. So that is, wow. <laughs> it's great, makes me happy. Um, I did get two thumbs down on it though. I guess you can't please everybody, but it's got a, like a 95% approval rating. So that's, that's good. Um, so I got something else I want to talk about. What was it? Oh, my Nathan vest. Yeah, well, my vapor car vest. I got a couple Nathan vests, but this one. Um, I said before in a previous video that I was gonna update you all uh, on what Nathan said about this thing wearing out. Um, in the, the where the iPhone goes, it's worn a hole into where the bottle is, and and then up here the stitching's coming loose. So I sent some pictures to Nathan and told him what was going on. Sent him a picture of my my order from Amazon, and the very next email I got from Nathan was, "Hey, no problem. We're going to take care of you. Uh, a replacement will be on its way." And within 10 days, I got a. A vest with uh, new bottles and everything just like I ordered from Amazon so big shout out to Nathan for taking care of their customers so anyway look forward to those videos and thanks for watching and until next time